Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. New leadership, a host of new faces, and some very familiar problems await the Oregon legislature. The new legislature is focusing on housing and homelessness. Bola Badabo is live at the Capitol this evening. Bola? Today is the first day of Oregon's 2023 legislative session. After three years of virtual meetings, it's back here in Salem at the Capitol in person. Today I spoke with a variety of political leaders that discuss many hot button issues, one of which is housing. Take a listen. Housing, homelessness, and mental health. We agree with our colleagues across the aisle. These are immediate problems. Our goal is to expand the housing opportunities by cutting regulatory and permitting red tape while promoting a hand up process focused on results. We must ensure the solution for homelessness provides shelters and services and is not just a slush fund for for-profit nonprofits. Oregon is seeing the impact of over two years of COVID-19 lockdowns and our mental health workforce is bearing the weight. Investments need to be made to support this sector. Local communities and parents deserve the tools to provide their communities and children with access to treatment. The governor indicated that she wants to build 36,000 units a year, which is a substantial increase over what we currently do. So we're currently behind over 100,000 units statewide. And so uh, if you do 36,000 a year, it's going to take you that, uh, it's going to take you about three years to catch up. And so the sooner the better, we should have started, you know, a while ago. But uh, it's critically important that we're successful in this effort. Things will stay as they are if Measure 114 isn't enforced. And uh, obviously there's some legal issues surrounding it. And so the question is, is do you allow the courts to rule on those before you implement it versus after? And, uh, you know, it's my belief that uh, the courts need to rule on some of these issues. Uh, as they have in other states. And so I think it's really important that uh, we uh, essentially abide by um, the people's right to keep and bear arms, the Second Amendment. As the session progresses over the next few months, we'll keep you updated on the process. In Salem, Bola Badebo, News Channel 21.